Hey Capricorn, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs, welcome and welcome cross watchers. I hope that you're all having a fantastic day so far. I'm going to be taking a look at what's manifesting for you, what's going on right now in your current situation with you and the person that is on your mind, if any. So whenever you do come across this reading, it will be the right time for you to see it. As always, take what resonates, leave out the rest. Practice using your own discernment. And if you are interested in a personal reading, I will leave all of that information in the description box below for you all. And don't forget to uh, follow, subscribe, like, and click the notification bell if you're interested in receiving notifications for future videos. Also, don't forget to follow me on all social media, TikTok, Instagram. I am Spiritually Goldie on all platforms. So let's take a look, Capricorn. You've done a lot of healing. You've been through a lot. I'm seeing that you've received a message, um, communication from someone that has to do with healing or has given you the opportunity to heal. So I'm seeing that you've been contemplating something in this moment of healing. I'm seeing that you've been working on yourself and like just doing your own thing, focusing on you and focusing on your career, your work. You, you've been very independent for yourself. Um, I'm seeing you've been single. You've been doing, again, doing your own thing and you started to see results out of a situation that you worked really hard on. You work, you've worked so hard on yourself, Capricorn, and it's starting to show. I see that you've been contemplating a decision with a relationship around you. We have the lovers here, and it's like because you've worked so hard on yourself and because of the fact that it took you so long to get to where you are, you needed time to think about it and to heal and rest and kind of be on your own for the time being. I'm seeing that there was someone around you showing up as a seven of cups. So you may have felt like this person, like this person needed to make a choice about something. They may have had other options or other choices and I'm seeing that there's a level of confusion or distractions. You may have felt like even if they don't have other options, you've been looking at this person like they've been distracted. So let's take a look at you right now. Wow, I'm seeing a proposal. Somebody wants to make you a proposal, Capricorn, an offer here that is being made for you. You could possibly be a mature woman, older or dealing with one. I'm seeing there can, may also be children involved. There may be a child in the picture as well. But you're not totally feeling confident about what's being offered to you. Queen of Wands reversed and the Queen of Swords reversed. Yeah, it's like you still need more clarity when it comes to this 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 big thing that somebody's trying to give you we have the empress around you so again somebody there's a mother somebody is a mother here somebody's try, and, and in a different like more general sense this person is trying to nurture this situation with you and show you their their unconditional and their large amount of love abundant love that they have for you this person wants to make you their wife or their husband this person wants you to be um a family they want marriage with you like this person is making you a big big offer here but you're not totally sold by this i'm seeing that the hangman reverse is telling me there's still a decision that you're trying to make, although you're still holding on to this. 
death reversed, I'm seeing that you're still holding on to this person or you're still with this person or in communication because I do see um, text messages. So you may be in communication or this person wants to message you and make a proposal to you um, showing you that they want to nurture and make a commitment, a big, big commitment. This isn't just a small commitment. I'm seeing you're not trying to rush into things. Prince of Swords reversed. You're holding back. I'm seeing you're holding back because you're not completely sure. There's still healing that needs to be done. There's still time. I'm hearing I need time or someone needs time. I'm getting that there's some unfinished business that you have with this person. Something hasn't come to a closure and it's like this is someone's way of trying to I get 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 past this. So, let's take a look at this person. This person is very tempted by you. We have the devil, the 7 of cups. Wow, King of Cups, the Magician, damn. This person views you as their world. They look at you like you are somebody who they could have a life with. They want to share the world with you. But they're confused to your response. Their, your response to what they're trying to offer you is confusing you. They look at the situation as it's a little bit confusing. But they want to open up their heart to you with that King of Cups there. They have a lot of love to give and this person has very mature feelings for you. Maybe you're dealing with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpio here. But they really want to make you an offer coming from their heart. And they want to explore this with you, with that magician. They want to explore what a commitment would look like with you. And doing whatever it takes to show you that they're ready. To show you that they want to pursue this. But I'm seeing you have your guards up. You have your defenses up. Seven of Wands. I'm seeing that there's a friend around you who may not be completely um, happy about you and this person either in communication or being in a relationship together. You have a friend around you who has some concerns over this and you may get backlash from them. I'm seeing you receiving backlash to the point where you may feel like you need to defend yourself or you need to def you need to protect yourself from somebody's words. You're putting up boundaries. You're putting up boundaries when it comes to the people around you and friends around you. Yeah, Ace of Swords. You're putting your foot down. Like you're standing your ground here with what you believe in, what you're thinking. I see you speaking your truth. There's something that you're saying no to because you're trying to enforce better boundaries. But it's not the you're saying no, but you're not you're still not letting something go, letting the past go with that death reversed. It's like someone is still holding on to the past or whatever happened in the past, which is why you're trying to enforce better boundaries. But I see communication. I see you communicating and I see you um, communicating and bringing clarity to a situation. So you're going to find a large amount of clarity. And I do see that there's someone around you who they they're coming from a place of being very emotional. They're going to communicate to you from a place of not full maturity But I'm hearing regrets. This person regrets something. It's, but they haven't walked away. I'm saying this is something to do with a past 
situation or past person and you may receive this communication or this communication may happen while you're in a room setting in a family room or in your room like this communication will happen through text message so the past will come around though I'm seeing the coffin and unfinished business here but this situation we have the two of pentacles and the Princess of Wands. We also have the Ace of Swords. I see you eventually making a decision where you're going to try to do your best to resolve some unfinished business whatever unfinished business you have with this person or a friend like i see you two resolving this someone is coming back around this person will come back around five of wands reversed i see you being very honest and hope having an, an open and honest conversation the truth but this is going to lead you to a passionate new start with each other and making an effort to balance things out and to keep each other in each other's lives here. So whatever this this situation that you feel like isn't resolved or isn't being fixed, I see you two resolving it. The numbers I'm seeing is 7, 18, 6, 21, and 19. So with that being said, this is what I'm seeing. If it resonated, let me know. And if you made it this far in the video, thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you want. It helps me out and it helps the channel. And I hope that you all have an amazing rest of your day. Bye.